Tonight we're doing a big, hearty, healthy soup. We got turkey, sausage, squash, zucchini, potato, rice, celery, celery, carrots. That's about it. That's about it. Exactly. Oh, yeah. Everything but the kitchen sink, baby. Okay. Yeah, baby! What is this? Buttercup squash. Ooh, they should... That's a tough one. It should, it should cut, though. It's a sharp knife. Yeah. It's my baby. Whoa. Okay. Dude, I'm destroying it. <laughs> yeah! Ooh, baby. Check it out. Yeah. Right. Okay. Now you have to remove the, the outer yeah. screen. So I don't want to wreck your knife, so let's see if the potato peeler works. Should. Survey says. Survey says, oh my god, that's a big potato. <laughs> She's the green. It's working. So it's uh, 10 minutes later and Diego's finally... Uh, 10 minutes later. The only reason why, it all depends on how you like your soup. If you like uh, chunky bits, chunky pieces in your soup, I would suggest you cut these ones extra big, right? Like I'm talking maybe like that. Oh, I and see. And half because it'll stay whole. Right? Yeah, yeah. I'm doing it like this so it'll sort of dissolve. Exactly. All right, so that little zucchini produced this. <laughs> and we're going to use that big bad boy? I guess. I okay. Use. Diego uh, didn't realize they had a food processor. Check this out, baby. <laughs> Check it out. Ah. Watch your thumb, please. One, two, three. That next. Oh. Nah, beauty. How's that? That's perfect. This soup is gonna. It's an eight minute video, but it's going to take about two hours. Put it in. Put it in. Shut that. Put it in there. <laughs> what happened? I know you. <laughs> Cheese. So we're going to be putting some. Uh, uh, we're going to be chopping up some. I'm going to be chopping up some garlic. We're going to be cooking some sausages and some turkey, a turkey breast, and then we're going to eventually put it into the uh, soup. Very good. So, here we go. I like my garlic. Okay, so we're going to cut the sausages now? Yeah. So we'll let this go and we'll sort of make a little sauce out of it as well. And that will all go in there and should give it some added kick. Okay. So you don't want to put, shoes. You don't want to put a, a shitload of... Hey! <laughs> a lot of salt in there. Exactly. So we might as well get it out of what we have. For them. And done. That's a big slab, right? Yeah. So I just want to maybe shave it a little, shave it down a little. Something like this. But pieces that big, you're going to chop them in half. Yeah, just like this. See that? Maybe it's thinner, right? That's a big piece. Should we not chop it in half? If we want to do that, then yes. Chop then, it. Then you just chop it. Make strips out of them. Yeah, but I, I meant like smaller. Yeah. Pieces that you can butt put in, eat yeah. in your mouth without having to choke on it. <laughs> having to choke on it. There you go. Well, I didn't mean pieces that small, but. No, but well, that's fine. Like, you know. Garlic in. Can you? Teamwork, that's what it's all about, baby. Can we put any other types of herbs in here? Absolutely. Um, basil, oregano. Absolutely. This is basil? It's hard to see it when you film it. <laughs> Whoa! That's a lot! 
Hello. That's parsley. We're going to put some salt and pepper in here. That's good. Followed by some salt. I don't want to put too much because uh, we're going to use those, those what you call it? Potatoes? Bouillon cubes. Ah, uh, yes. So I'm going to put some paprika in here. Okay. Woo! Really, it's just to give color. Okay. And then you can... But what's the color for if we're just going to put in a soup? Because it looks kind of creepy, man. <laughs> <laughs> so we're basically cooking it until it's done. And then we're going to throw it in. See the, the, some of the juice that's already in there? Yep. We're gonna, so we'll we'll try that later. No, no, no. That's oh, going to go in. in. Okay. That's the equivalent of uh, the beef cube. So what are they called? Uh, bouillon, really. Yeah, bouillon. There we go. I'm just going to... Put some of that in there. Cutting them chunky. Yeah. Because I don't want them to sort of melt through, you know, like yeah. dissolve. So by the time the soup's ready, you still have some solid potato. Exactly. We got carbs, we got proteins, we got vegetables, we got everything we need. Yeah. Everything went to kitchen sink. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to grab that white wine and I'm going to pour it Now, I'm going to let you know that that white wine has been in the fridge for maybe that's okay. a good seven or eight months. No, that's fine. Okay. But, but it's in the fridge, right? So. Yeah. Safe. The red wine was already a casualty. <laughs> Ooh la la! Just pour it all in there. Woo! That's a drunk yeah. soup. Okay, let's do the zucchini sticks. Or do you need to do the celery? Oh, I forgot all about the celery, man. Celery, celery! <laughs> Diego has dipped into my refrigerator again and pulled out another... Look what I found! He found a pesto that I've used in the rib video. And so now we're scoop putting the meat in our big pot. Sausages. Ooh, la la. Holy mother of meat. <laughs> I want to grab as much of that flavoring and put it into our soup. Oh, I see. Yeah. Oh, wow. She's so clean. Okay, it's now 7.48. It's been in there for about two and a half hours and it's finally ready to go. The rice the last addition that we put in is finally soap and Diego is taking a big scoop big hearty healthy scoop check it out all right let's let's eat this okay and one and done all right here we go <laughs> oh.